today. Um, question first of all for Aaron and Jermaine. Did, did you enjoy the session this morning? And if we can ask, what were you working on? Yeah, the session was good. Obviously, like to obviously thank yous again. Obviously, for using the pitches and stuff like that. Um, we did a lot of like a um, little bit of finishing, like individual stuff, a little bit of finishing in and around the box, um, short, sharp stuff. Then we did some um, crossing with like uh, one defender in, two attacking. Then we did like one v ones, two v ones, just stuff that's sort of like game related. Um, it was another good session, so yeah, it was good. I enjoyed it. Yeah, it was nice. First, thanks for letting us use the facilities. It's been a top draw down here. Um, but yeah, it was sharp stuff. Um, like I said I've been doing mainly running, but to come back and get the ball again after a few weeks out um, was nice. A lot of crossing, a lot of finishing, um, one v ones, two v ones. Um, now good Duke said, put us through our paces. Yeah. To be able to use these facilities, I think they're amazing. I think yeah. it's so well kept, and to have these level, these level footballers at this kind of club shows you how well you're running your football club. So thanks so much for having us down. Yeah. How do you feel like being able to use a facilities like this with players like this? When it must be pretty good, must it? Yeah, no, it's just it's, it's good because obviously with such high level players, you got you want to have good standards as well. So to be able to play on a good pitch um, with such good facilities, it helps the session even more with the level they're already at. Aaron, Jermaine, this must does this match up to what you're used to usually? Yeah, but it's one of those ones. You, like at the end of the day, you know, two goals, you know, it's grass. You, you just got to you got to just play whatever you're given. So it's like you said, the pitches. Also, when I when I come over the first time, I was like, wow, it's good. Do you know what I mean? Um, and we've enjoyed it and it helps as players it helps when the pitch is good it helps you know the quality the standards high um so yeah was, I'm, I'm impressed the pitch is uh, the pitch is great like i said pitch doesn't make a difference but now the pitch is right up there um you can't complain if you're blaming this pitch you've got a problem so yeah. <laughs> kind of a no excuse yeah. that. if you're blaming the pitch you, 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 got, you got some problems i actually said to jermaine on the first session didn't i, I said this is actually a better setup than most some professional clubs in league yeah, one yeah, league yeah, two yeah, yeah, it's yeah. a lot better it's whole facilities so yeah yeah, yeah. So it's uh, better than some of the pro i came around so. this side to be fair the walk i was up there yesterday and even the pitches the training uh, pitches at the back the training yeah. pitches are good um Good setup, man. Very good setup. Especially with this being a non-league club as well, it's step three at the pyramid. How sort of how aware are the, the top-level players of sort of the pyramid below them, um, sort of level? You know, clubs like us. Um, like you said, we don't really know the, see the ins and outs of that. Do you know what I mean? So um, you can see, obviously, this this has been difficult for all clubs. So when you see the big yeah. boys losing money, you definitely know how much it's going to affect uh, yeah. smaller clubs. Definitely. So. Yeah, we just hope, like I said, for football, everyone loves it. We just hope everyone gets themselves back up and running. Um, like I said, the big, the big boys have got to do more for me to help the smaller clubs because, you know what I mean, without football, everyone loves it. It's for everyone, the kids, the future, like I yeah, said, yeah. so the bigger boys have got to do more for me.